The Utica Police Department sworn in 14 new officers this morning. Now these officers are ready for the police academy. Arjun Selig was there and she has more. It's been a lifelong dream for Becho Agachid to become a police officer. It's been a long and tough journey and just preparation and stuff for this. So. Today, the Utica Police Department has welcomed 14 new officers. This is supposed to be a class that started sometime in April. What ended up happening was, is uh, because of COVID-19, as you see, it almost got delayed to July, uh, almost July now. Chief Williams says it's been a challenge to find new recruits. The unrest that we saw with the uh, George Floyd hom uh, homicide, um, we saw it was already difficult to recruit as it was. We can't all be judged on one person's action, so I believe there's too many good officers here. I'm sure in every state, not just here, but all around the country. So Our police department reflects our community as far as hiring as well. So when we talk about diversity, I ask, also ask for the help of the community. The chief tells me after a year of struggling to find new recruits to join the force after today, they're about fully staffed. One, one currently down, and there'll be a lateral transfer that we're going to hire some point next week when we get all the paperwork all, all done. So we'll actually be hiring 15. And the nice thing is about the, the, the one we'll be adding, he's already a certified police officer, and we can add him immediately right to the streets. I'm just looking forward to getting into the academy and starting my career. In Utica, Jen Selig, Eyewitness News. And these recruits will undergo 24 weeks of academy training, followed by 12 weeks of field training.